What is up everyone, Mr. Raviator here bringing you another episode of The Sims 4 Dine Out here on Aviator Games. So you guys, last time we left off, Isabella and Alfonso were attempting to have a baby, and we ended the episode on a cliffhanger. So none of, none of you guys know, and I don't know if she's pregnant, but we're going to find out in just a second. But you guys, before we get into this episode, don't forget to show that like button some love. If you guys enjoy the series and you want to support the show and the channel, uh, if you have the ability to like the video, please do. And also, I want to mention right now, listen up guys, this is super important at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time today, that's 7 p.m. Central and 8 p.m. Eastern, I will be streaming five hours of The Sims 4. So if you guys want to tune in for a five-hour Sims 4 dine-out stream, all you have to do is click the link down below in the description. It says live stream. Click that, follow me, and wait for 5 p.m. PST, that's Pacific Standard Time, oh, and that's 7 p.m. Central and 8 p.m. Eastern. So if you guys want to come, click the link down below in the description, follow, and just stay on that page until I go live. Okay, so uh, it's going to be a really, really good time. Uh, but okay, let's get started with this episode by first seeing if, uh, you know, Isabella's pregnant. That's going to be key. Now, we do have quite a bit of money left, too. Even though our restaurant's kind of failing, uh, we still have a little bit of money left, and we should be able to, you know, add another room for our kid and, and all that kind of good stuff. So hopefully, <laughs> hopefully she's pregnant. Come on, Isabella, give us the good news. <laughs> She's pregnant! She's eating for two! Oh my god, guys! We are pregnant! Okay, hold on. We gotta get a picture of this. Like, look at this. <laughs> She's like, I did it. I I pee peed. Okay, you, you did do it, Isabella. And I'm proud of you. Like, look at, look at that. Guys, she did it. She's pregnant. <laughs> I'm happy. I'm sure Alfonso's gonna be very excited. But it's, it's almost 9 o'clock at night. We should actually try to get some sleep. So, go to bed. Yeah. Don't talk to each other. He, she's sharing the news that she's pregnant. I don't know why Alfonso's embarrassed. Why are you embarrassed, Alfonso? Uh, privacy invaded Sims don't like having someone walk in on them in the buff. Well, uh, I didn't know anyone walked in on them. Oh, Marie, what are you doing? You still eating? You've been eating that fruit salad for... Why is she embarrassed? <gasps> she walked in on Alfonso. Oh, Marie. Okay, so let's have her clean all this up. Clean all this up, Marie, and then you can even, uh, you can finish eating the fruit salad, and then you can go clean that up. And I think she's got to go to the bathroom pretty bad, so we're going to allow her to use that, take a shower, and then she's going to go to bed kind of late for being an old lady, so <laughs> we got to get her in bed as soon as possible. Now, I think we're going to have Alfonso, since uh, Isabella's pregnant, we're going to have Alfonso run the shop. Uh, it should be an interesting day. You guys, you guys gave me, like, a lot of tips and tricks over the last few days, um, to learn from, and I'm really excited, and I, I think I learned some good stuff about running a restaurant, and I think I can do some, I don't know, some stuff to improve our restaurant, so let's go downstairs. Uh, is she asleep? Everyone's sleeping. Good, good, good. And then he's got to just eat breakfast, and then we're going to be out of here. We're going to be head off to the restaurant and try to make a name for ourselves. Our restaurant was having some success, but lately, you know, we were a three-star, but we're just not making any money. Uh, business funds, 1200 We have 7100 So we have, like, we're worth, like, $8,000 right now. What can we get with our perks? Uh, curious customers makes customers occasionally wish for a recommendation. Okay. Ingredient quality options unlocks the ability to choose the quality. We already did that. Meal rush. For 24 hours, more customers will stop in to eat at your restaurant. No, we don't want that. We don't want anything that's, like, timed. Okay, so patient. Patron or Patreon or patrons. <laughs> we want pa more patient customers. Actually, that wouldn't be a bad one because we're kind of slow at delivering our food, so that might actually help us get our rating up to like a four or a five. Okay, so let's quickly eat and then we gotta get out of here. We gotta get outy. Oh god, we did not even go to the bathroom yet. And eh, we can always go at the restaurant. Just stop talking. You don't have time to chit chat. We gotta get there and run a restaurant. I want to run all day. I want to run it from like nine o'clock in the morning until like ten o'clock at night. We're going to try to run an amazing restaurant today, so let's let's go ahead. We're going to travel to the restaurant with Alfonso. Uh, Isabella's going to stay home, trying to have that baby in the next three to four days. And Marie, obviously, she's old, so she'll stay home, too, and he'll help Isabella, I guess, and hang out. Okay, so please, restaurant, be a lot more successful today than what you have been. It's been pretty bad lately, guys, not going to lie. Okay, so let's quickly have uh, Alfonso go to the bathroom. Since he's got to do that. And then we can probably flush the toilet so it doesn't break. And then wash our hands so everything's clean and sanitary for the day. Let's open the restaurant, though. So we're open for business around 7 in the morning. So let's see how today goes. <laughs> uh, let's click on this. Okay, disallow new customers? No, we're going to allow new customers all day. We are going to do something with the menu. You guys were telling me I could edit the restaurant menu and load a preset. So let's do Italian preset. Yes. 
Okay, so there we go. Now we're, we have a fully stocked Italian menu. Uh, and you guys told me about that, so that should work out really well. We have our sh everyone dressed up really nice. We got the better quality food. We're doing, uh, let's do a gold advertising package, and we're going to just see how today goes. Well, we're giving it its all today, guys. We are just, like, doing it up today, hoping for the best. So clean up all the tables, bus boys. It's going to get really intense today. Let's clean this up. Okay, they already did. They're on par today. Now, I do want to do more training, but training is getting wicked expensive so I think maybe we train the chefs because that will make them faster, um, which is good. That's something we need. Uh, we got to train them as much as we can, but obviously we're not making a ton of money. So uh, we got to be sparing with our training. Like anyone who needs basic training, uh, we'll, we'll still train them. But anyone that needs like higher level training, I guess they'll have to wait. I think this guy still needs basic training. No, he needs higher level training. This guy definitely needs higher level training. Where's our other waiter? Don't we have three? Oh, there he is. Wait, where'd he go? Where'd he go? He just, like, disappeared. <gasps> oh, no. The polar vortex. Okay. Hold on. We have a customer. We have two customers. Okay. Let's go uh, welcome the customers here and let them know that we appreciate them coming by. Okay. So we're spending money on training all of our staff. Uh, okay. So right here. This guy, does he need training still? Does he need? No. Brief training. The training skill has been... Uh, Okay, so wait, why can't we train? Oh, we don't have funds for it. Okay, so good. Okay, so everyone's trained up to the $600 range except her and the other chef that we just hired. So I guess we're going to keep working on that. So we're introducing ourselves. We're making sure everything's going well. We're going to check in on the table as well. Just make sure everything's going great. Okay, welcome to the restaurant. We're going to talk to the waiter. He's going to take care of everything. Oh, there's a little girl and Bella's here now. Okay, so let's welcome them to the restaurant. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Come on, sit everyone down. Sit everyone. Okay, we have 600. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Okay, so let's get this more patient customers boom done Okay, so everyone's gonna be a lot more patient, which is great because that's gonna help our, re our review our rating Okay, so there we go sit down sit them seat them. We need two host stands. I'm telling you our host is so slow So we're gonna go we're gonna go chill in the kitchen because I don't want to be in anyone's way And I want them to just be able to seat people so let's let's have them seat everyone and then we're gonna check in on tables. How is this little girl here by herself? Well, I guess we'll just check in on her table And we'll check in on this table see how they're doing and is that Nancy Langrab? Is she here again? Okay, and then we got Bella here. What is she doing? Let's check in on her table and then there's another kid sitting by himself Oh, there's Mortimer. Is that is that their son? Alexander Goth it is. Okay. Okay. Okay, so let's let's we're not gonna prioritize anyone's food right now But we're gonna welcome anyone and everyone Okay, so is there anything we can do? We're going to prioritize their food <clears throat> since, uh, you know, they got here first. Let's see management. Let's welcome him. And then let's also welcome her. So we're chatting with every single person right now. We're, we're trying to make the best of this situation that we can. And as you can see, we're already making some profits on today. So that's perfect. we got to run this food as fast as possible. We have some four-star experiences over here. Uh, Three-star over here. So let's go check in on their food. It's here. So you guys said not to give so much free drinks and free desserts anymore. But I'm just trying to get a better rating right now, and if uh, free drinks are going to do that for me, that's that's what I want to do. So let's go offer them some free drinks on the house, and then we're going to check in on this table, make sure everything's going well. Okay, the restaurant chef, Tara, needs more training to cook everything on the menu. To avoid poor quality meals, choose out lower difficulty foods. Dang. Okay, so we really got to get this girl trained, man. We got to get this girl trained, like, now. Okay, so there we go. Anyone else got their food yet? Does anyone else? Do we even introduce ourselves to this girl? Okay, let's welcome her. She must have snuck in. Where are the food reviewers? Are there any food reviewers here right now? Oh, God, I hope not. I don't feel like we're ready for food reviewers just yet. Okay, so it looks like this is ready to get cleaned up. Let's help out the waiters. Try to keep these great ratings coming in. Oh, come on, come on. Okay, so we cleared the tables. Uh, is there anything we can do? Prioritize their food. They already got their food, so we're going to come in here and we're going to say, hey, you know what? Uh, if you guys really like this food, wait, 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 why can't I? Where's the restaurant interactions? Are they done eating? Oh, they're already eating dessert, aren't they? Are they eating dessert? No, they're not. So why can't I give them options? Oh, they're already pretty much done. Okay, so they must have paid. So let's go talk to these guys. We're going to give uh, the, des the table a free dessert. Now, I go to restaurants here in L.A. all the time, and, and a lot of restaurants will bring you free desserts. 
even if you had an amazing time, just to, you know, put the cherry on top, like, boom, I hope you come back, you know? Uh, let's, uh, give her a free drink. So, yeah, we're spending a little bit of money, but that's okay. You know, you gotta spend money to make money, and Alfonso knows this, okay, guys? Okay, so free desserts for them. Now we're checking our phone. Free drinks for her. Uh, it looks like they're having a four-star experience. Everyone's having four Ooh, she's having a five-star experience. We're gonna prioritize that food, keep that five-star rating coming in and we have a new customer here let's welcome him in and and see how he's doing see what brings him by our part of the woods today okay so this restaurant's doing great we we did the gold advertising package today it's only one o'clock and we've already made really good money today Let, let's go look okay net profit we're actually in the green then we had three days in a row guys if you don't remember where we were losing money every single day and today we've already made two hundred dollars in total profit we made four hundred six dollars or no, $820 in sales, then cost of ingredients, then meal profits 406 but then we had wages and advertising. But man, we're doing really good. Now we have excellence. Our service is excellent. Wow, your staff are renowned for their impeccable service. They're always friendly and skilled in what they do. Growth opportunities, meal quality, and personal touch. Try interacting with your customers more. They'll appreciate the owner's attention. I'm doing that. What? I guess they have to give me something to improve anyways, you know, even though we're doing our best. Let's give the table free dessert right here to help this table's review out. Okay, and then let's go see what she's doing. Management, let's give her free drinks. You guys, we're trying to help every table out here, giving them some good stuff. Let's go to management here. We're going to welcome, and then we're going to check up on the table as well. We're doing everything we possibly can right now just to, to make this the best experience for every single person. She had a five-star experience. Five stars, five stars. Oh, my God, guys. We're killing it right now. We are killing it. Okay, so let's check in on the table, and we're going to prioritize. Oh, no, 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 don't rudely introduce yourself. We're going to prioritize his food. <clears throat> we want them to get their stuff first. Okay, so he, we have another new customer. Jesus, this day is going so well, guys. Okay, so let's see here. Let's chit-chat with her. Welcome to the restaurant. Look at everyone's five-starring right now. Okay, we have this table over here. They are not five-starring. Let's prioritize their food as well. <coughs> oh, man. Okay. Look at this, guys. We went up a half a star. We're three and a half stars. Our meal quality does need to improve, though, so we need to give more training to our chefs. Johnny is very unsatisfied with his job. Try giving a promotion or encourage him to improve his morale. Uh-oh. Johnny, we don't want to lose you. You were, like, here from the very beginning, Johnny. So we're going to manage you. We're going to promote you to waiter level two. Uh, yeah, let's do that, okay? Here, let, let's, give, let's give you a little promotion, dude. You deserve it, man. You've been, you've been busting your butt out here. There you go. He's happy. A promotion for me? I Well, of course, it's about time, I mean. Thank you, Mr. Costa. It's an honor. Okay, so he's excited. I think I'm going to give him a promotion, too. Let's keep some of our waiters, you know, high-level guys. Uh, and then maybe we should give our host a promotion, too. Did he actually get the promotion? Did he actually accept the promotion? Level 2 waiter. There we go. Come on, man. I'm trying to promote you. We're, we're, we're trying to get all of our staff up here a little bit. We should probably promote this guy, too. Level 2 host. We're giving everyone promotions. Everyone deserves it. And he's happy. I knew you were a great boss no matter what everyone else says. Dang it. I'm an amazing boss. Don't let other people talk crap about me. Okay, so let's see. What else can we do to manage? We already prioritized his food. Uh, these guys are having a four-star experience, so let's go and give them a free dessert. Try to bump it to five stars, guys. That's the goal today. Get our restaurant to a four-star restaurant and try to show everyone that what Mr. Costa is doing here is amazing. Okay, <clears throat> so I don't even know if we welcome these people. Let's check out on the table, and then we're going to prioritize their food because I feel bad for them. We didn't even really notice they came in. Can we welcome any of these people? No. Okay, so we're going to check in on them. We're going to tell them that we're putting priority on their food. We want their food coming out first. Okay, so let's check here. Uh, it looks like everything's just going amazing. Okay, so we have another person sitting down here. This is Nancy Langrab, so let's welcome her to the restaurant and check in on the table. See how everything's going with her. Add in that personal touch, guys. That's what it's all about. Okay, so we have pretty much a 1,000 points right now. Let's see what we can get. Okay, so additional chef, no. We already have patient patrons. Uh, inspirational speech, no. Fast eaters, customers will eat their meals faster. Uh, lower employee training costs. Oh, my God, we got to save up for that one, guys. Um, tidy tippers, uh, well managed. What's this? Lowers the chance of bad events. The chef's hat unlocks an additional chef hat for your sims. Okay, so we're going to try to save up so we can get the uh, faster eaters and stuff. We're going to save up for all that. Or no, lo lower training costs. That's what we're saving up for. Okay, so we have another new customer here. Let's welcome her and check in on the table. That's what we're trying to do, guys. We're just trying to be the best owner we possibly can be. 
put out the best food. We've already been open since like 7 this morning, so it's almost 10 hours. These guys are having an amazing experience, it looks like, though, and uh, it looks like they're going to walk out with a 4 and a 5 star. We just need more 4 and 5 stars. Uh, let's prioritize this food. Didn't we already do that? Did we give her anything free? No, we didn't. I think we did, yeah. Okay, so she's ordering. Okay, so both of them, everyone's being taken care of right now. So we're going to disallow new customers. No one new right now. Um, we're going to just, you know, allow nobody else to come in. We're going to actually request a table ourselves because we want to eat, you know. We want to see what's up. So we're going to see how good our, uh, our restaurant experience is. So there we go. He's seating us. And now we can uh, order, right? Can I click one of these guys and order? Restaurant. Uh, order for table. Let's do it. We want to order. Okay, so we're going to get... Huh, no appetizer. We just want roasted chicken. Okay. No, 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 no. We're an Italian restaurant. We should get spaghetti. Let's get the spaghetti, guys. Okay, let's just do that. Just spaghetti. That's all we want. I just want to see how good of spaghetti we make. How good of spaghetti we brew up here. Okay, come on. Bring me my, my, my spaghettis. Okay, we're not allowing new customers. Basically, everyone's getting their food, and then everyone's going to be leaving. Okay, so can we give them free dessert? Can we? we is she by herself? Oh my god, we didn't even check on her. Oh my god, I didn't know she was by herself. Okay, so there we go. Welcome her. Okay, so there we go. Let's go back and sit down. We're, we're, we're trying to rest here. This is our table, so we're going to just chill here. Relax and wait for our food. Let's see how long of a process this really is. Okay, come on, guys. Come on, guys. Prioritize the food. Get the food out here. We're having bad experiences here. We're having bad experiences. I'm not very happy with the wait times. What's going on, man? I thought we disallowed new customers. Oh, no. This guy looks like a food critic. Let's welcome him and uh, check in on the table. We want him to know that we're here for him. Just checking in to make sure everything's good. And Johnny Grow is starting to get tired from work. He's going to start making mistakes, guys. We're going to start making some mistakes here. Oh, they're getting... We're not seating any new customers. Stop seating new people. Oh, my God. Close the restaurant. Close the restaurant. Net profit minus $186 on the day. God dang it. We lost money again? Uh, everyone get out of here. Jesus. Get out of here. Okay, so let's clean up all this. Get this mess put away. Uh, let's clean up this. I don't know what went wrong, but I think we're getting closer to becoming more profitable. I just don't know why we're not profitable yet. Uh, but I know we're getting closer, and that's all that matters. Oh, my God, this is bad. Okay, so let's replace. There we go. Nice. Everything's clean at this restaurant. We're so broke, though. But, guys, I think this is where we're going to end this episode of The Sims 4 Dine Out. And hopefully we can get stuff fixed up before the next episode. But don't forget to come to the live stream. Like I said, the link is down below. Follow me on there and because uh, we're going to stream quite often like Sims, GTA, all that good stuff. But thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, we're going to take it easy. Live and squeezy.